Hello hackers, welcome to the new video where we are going to hack Improtected Admin Functionality Lab from Web Security Academy and powered by Portswega. So in this lab, we are going to find Improtected Admin Panel and then we are going to use its functionality to delete the user call it callous. So this lab is very easy. So before moving forward, guys, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and let's start. And uh, here we go, guys. So the first step, let me activate Foxy Proxy. I'm using Community Edition. And then let's go to the proxy, enter spec twice, and let's go to HTTP history. So the first step, I'm going to map the application and then maybe I will find a way to find this admin panel. So let me scroll down and see what I have in here. So as you can see, I have several of items in here. So this is a similar of e-commercial website. Let me visit one of them. And here we go. So this is the first item, call it more than just Burton. Let me see if I can find a username or something in here. So nothing is interesting. There isn't any comments or any user publisher. So let me see its endpoint. Maybe I will find something in here. So this is its HTML code. Let me see. So nothing looks interesting. Okay, so let me see if I can find a comment. So in HTML, it's looking like this. Okay, as you can see, nothing is matched, so we don't have any comments. Let me delete it, and let me see if I can find maybe a user. And here we go, also nothing matched. So let me scroll up and let me see this functionality in here, call it my account. And here we go, maybe I will try admin and password of admin. Let me see. Okay, invalid username or password. So let me see if I can find something in the login. Let me see if there is any comment. Let me use a user word. Okay, we have three matches. So the first one is the user label, which means this one. And then we have the input type of user and the name of username. So nothing interesting in here. So in the previous video and the information disclosure, I used robots.txt to find uh, some hidden directory. I will try this one and see if I can find something using robots.txt. So let me go to the URL. So let me remove this directory and let me try robots.txt and let me see what I'm going to find. And here we go. Now I found something that this allowed in here. So let me just copy it. So if you're not very familiar about robots.txt, this is a generated file is going to remove any specific directory that you don't want to show it in the Google search or something similar like it. So which means if you are going to search about this website in Google, so this endpoint is going to be hidden for the search. So let me just copy it now and let me use it in here. And let me see what I'm going to find. And here we go, guys. So this is definitely the admin panel. And in here we have some functionality. We can delete user winner or a callous. And my duty is to delete the callous user. So let me delete it. And here we go. Now we finally solve the lab. So guys, I hope that you learned something new about how to find the admin panel and how to use robots.txt that can help you to find some hidden directory. So guys, if you liked my video, please don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and if you have any question or need any help, please put it in the comment below and stay tuned for the next videos.